So Dad, why don't you tell them about all the process and the major challenges that we've had across the years? <laughs> Whoops. Okay, this is a great question, a long answer, and I will. I can write a book about it, but I will um, try to make a brief answer. And I, I think of it as marriage. Um, it is beautiful. It's hard work. Um, and it's uh, the foundation to build your family. So, if uh, and your happiness. So, if, if someone gives you a budget, you would never do it. You need, uh, but if someone gives you a son and a daughter, you would love them forever. So, I really think about this as, as part of the family. I mean, it's, it's, it's like a son to me. And, and the good thing is that all the family got involved. My son and daughters, my wife, everybody's on, on board and in charge of certain things. So the process is long. You need patience, focus, and be particular. No, no compromise, no concessions because every little part is very important. Uh, so the first years we only dedicated our efforts into the vineyards. So we were understanding the vineyards, planting new vineyards, and at the end everybody says you can make bad wine with good fruit. So that's basically what we the first years we 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 focus on, on, on the vineyards. It's it's a, one of the most beautiful gifts of nature, seeing the vines through the seasons, uh, going from nor uh, dormant to the spring and the flowering and then the fruit comes and then harvest comes. So it's really a, truly a blessing of nature. And then the craftsmanship of the wine probably is the most critical and the strongest part of the process because uh, it has so many parts, right? It, 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 you need the, the part of uh, harvesting and crushing and press, fermentation, maturation, uh, uh, bottling, uh, well, the barrels, aging. So all this uh, part is it's very critical. From farming to winemaking. From farming to winemaking. And in this process, yes, there's a lot of challenges. Um, and uh, Mother, and Mother Nature has given us a lesson. The last few years we had a, a lot of challenges with the fires in Northern uh, California. But we managed to, we're a strong community, we managed to to do great wines. Uh, in 2017, it was tough for some of our friends. And in 2024 hours, we're not gonna have that vintage. But we are learning, and I think there's something uh, good about all this process. Uh, we need to be more conscious and, and, and learn about the, our world and the world we live in. And including the pandemic, I think there's a, a silver lining about all of this. So there's a lot of challenges, but we have to work through them and, and make this happen. So why don't we talk about wine now? And you can tell them what's to uh, like to make Cabernet Sauvignon in, in Napa Valley today, and we can taste it. Well. That's an easier question than the last one, but uh, it's it's a a, a very a good question. Uh, well, my dad's passion for Cabernet Sauvignon was what brought us to the valley, and uh, of course, the valley is full of these very meticulous and very well done people, and I mean. They, the competition is amazing. I mean, they are doing great, great wines out of Napa. So I guess 
at the end, what really drove Cervantes was uh, getting a, a sense of place uh, where mount, mountain grape were uh, tucked into the northeast part of the, of the valley. Uh, our elevation is 750 feet above sea level. So uh, all those things were what really, what really drove the character of, of Cervantes and understanding the vineyards like my dad said and uh, manicuring the, the way we, we wanted them. So at the end, uh, we, we, what we have on the bottle is what we really uh, liked. I mean, sitting down with, with Andy and having my dad there and Patrick and uh, listening to, to all of uh, each other's ideas and their, their, their people on the table so prepared and it's just a magical moment. So it's been a, an amazing uh, ride. It's, it's, it has enlightened my life for sure. And it just, just the, the whole process that my dad just mentioned, is, it's, it's amazing from farming to winemaking, that craftsmanship and all that um, passion that people have it's what what really we have on 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 the on on the bottle, right? So let's as, try it. Yeah, yeah. Let's 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 have a sip of the 2016 Cervantes, and at the end, uh, what we are uh, focusing here is is what our palate uh, loves and what what we really can get from our land. So. I just want to make a very small uh, uh, comment. Uh, so here, maybe some of you guys are thinking what we have here on the label, and it's our family crest. So uh, we have all the initials of the family. So Sa Savior, uh, Cecilia, Geronimo on the side, then Anna and Jimena, and then uh, the five of us are up here, one, two, three, four, five, and it's it kind of represents a fortress and it's very family oriented and um, we're, we're Mexicans and well people uh, are very family oriented uh, here, so uh, we going back a little bit to the wine, uh, the 2016 vintage was a uh, uh, beautiful growing season, no heat spikes, it was very mild, so we have a very balanced wine here. Uh, the, the, the wine is um, very, what we, 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 it's a very Bordeaux cut kind of wine, uh, more, more of a European, it's not your regular Napa Cab, but um, that's what we wanted to achieve. So, uh, it's 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 a, a very balanced wine. I, I love the nose on it. It has a, a lot of a baking spices, a licorice, and a, well, also a lot of a, earthy notes. That it's 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 what we we get from our land. And um, well, going on on the on the taste profile, it's a very balanced wine. The tannins are not very overwhelming. Uh, it's very smooth across the palate. So uh, at the end, we we just like uh, well, like my dad said, he wanted to open a bottle and drink it himself. So uh, I think we 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 achieved it, and it's it's a beautiful wine. So we're just happy to share it with all of you across across the ocean. And cheers to you. <laughs> Salud.